Welcome to my video and today's video has to do with a woman smuggling drugs using a baby. All right, so here we go. Brownsville mom accused of smuggling 13 pounds of cocaine in car with the baby. Brownsville, Texas, Valley Central. This town where I live, Brownsville, is a border town. The border is about 10, 12 minutes from here. All right. So a bond has been set for a Brownsville woman accused of smuggling 13 pounds of cocaine in a car while, while driving her baby records show. Marisa Castillo was arrested April 28th, just recently, on charges of possession with intent to distribute and control substance. You know, poor lady. And a lot of other people, too, who are put in this position with how things are going right now. You know, obviously this poor lady is put into a situation where she has to do what she has to do. You know, she has a kid. But again, you know, prevention. She might have not had to do this if she prevented from you know, maybe having a child. Maybe you should just, just just be you. Just some advice. Anyways, on Wednesday, her bond was set at 50 grand, according to federal records. At 5.25 a.m. on April 28th, Castillo entered the U.S. with her two-month-old daughter. Wow, two months. Ma'am, oh my God. She's, she's going to lose that baby. <sighs> Two-month-old daughter through the vehicle lane in a Chevy Malibu at Brownsville and Matamoros port of entry. A criminal complaint stated. God. A canine alerted agents and searched the vehicle to reveal a non-factory compartment. In the driver, the passenger, and rear seat of the car. Excuse me, let me reread that. Non-factory compartment in the driver, comma, passenger and rear seat of the car. That's just what it reads. Sounds a little funny, but hey. There, officers discovered six bundles in a compartment containing a white powdery substance which tested positive for cocaine. In total, the bundles weighed 13.5 pounds, the complaint stated. Castillo was interviewed by HSI agents and admitted to smuggling the cocaine in exchange for money. See? And documents revealed. See? Right now, a lot of people are suffering. Okay, um, and a lot of people are suffering with probably what happened in their past, maybe some trauma, maybe some abuse, poor people couldn't find relief. Uh, some people don't ever get over that kind of thing. And you know, sometimes you have to do what you gotta do. And unfortunately, this is what, uh, what it sounds like this poor lady had to do uh, what she had to do. And you know, my heart goes out to that lady and you are watching unapologetic gentleman with mario and you will find me obviously on youtube under unapologetic gentleman at mario vega 931 this is a channel where we talk about local news because this is a border town and for those who are interested who live maybe up north or maybe in the west or maybe in the east wherever you live this is news that is coming down on your border, you know, where the uh, administration doesn't want to send help and where they just currently send 1500 National Guard people to look over the border. Hey, listen, uh, how about you subscribe? All right, leave me a like, things like that. Help the channel out. This is a, a new channel. It's about maybe three or four months old. I also have another channel where it, we talk about uh, trauma, neglect, and things like that that happen in your family that obviously holds a lot of people 
back from really reaching for the stars. So thank you for being here. This concludes the video. This is Unapologetic Gentleman at Mario Vega 931. And I will see you in another video.